that's how I build my YouTube setup. What's going on guys? My name is Chris Sow and this week we're talking about three tips on how you can make $500 this weekend with photography and videography. No more chit chat, we're gonna get right into it. Woo! So I have a ton of friends who are extremely talented at photography and videography, but they don't know how to turn their skill set into actual hard earned cash. So here's tip number one, batch shooting. That's the name that I call it. It's just essentially batching a bunch of photo shoots into one. So an example being a couple years back, I went on Facebook and said, hey, who needs a headshot for their LinkedIn profile done? 50 bucks this weekend, pick a time slot and I'll book 10 of you. And in that weekend, I made 500 bucks super quickly. I batched everybody in about a 10 to 15 minute period at one location, gave myself about five minutes in between each person's, and essentially I would just be like, hey Sandra, welcome, bring them in, take their headshot, one or two options, and I would keep repeating that with Jordan or Susan or Anthony or a bunch of other Caucasian names I just listed off. But you can essentially bulk shoot them so that you can get them all done in one, and it doesn't just have to be LinkedIn headshots, it could be photo shoots for couples, and you don't always have to charge $50 a head times 10, you could also do $100 a head times five. You can batch these photo shoots so you can simply stack everybody on a single day and then edit all those photos that evening or the following day. And in that way, you can make a quick, easy buck in a very short period of time. So batch photography. Tip number two is stock photography. Now in this example, you might not make $500 right up front, but you're gonna make $500 or more over a long period of time. Now there's different websites out there. They're like Shutterstock, video blocks, videohive.net, and a bunch of other examples. So you can upload some stock photography assets to these and start making some passive income while you're sleeping. So I'll go to these websites, research what really sells well, and start making your own different high quality assets so that you can start making all this passive money. Like I said, you might not make all this money this weekend, but you're gonna make the money over a longer period of time. A good friend of mine has actually made $150,000 over two years with stock photography. And each weekend he goes out and shoots different things that he thinks will sell well, hires different models, and maybe his upfront costs were a few thousand dollars, but he's made quite a bit of money passively. Find different niches so that you can make money quicker, but ultimately stock photography is a very good option to consider. Tip number three, sign up for these different custom agencies that exist. Now in one of my previous videos, I talked about this. There's a website called flashstock.com and I'm pretty sure they just got bought out by Shutterstock and now it's called Shutterstock Custom. I'll link it below so you can sign up for this website and different jobs will get sent to you based on your portfolio. I'm not not sponsored by this company and by the way I just really think that it's a great way for you to make quick money and I really want you to get some value out of this so this is not an ad just so you guys know full transparency ultimately you sign up for this website upload your portfolio and you're gonna start getting jobs sent to you so an example that I had is I signed up for the website a few years back I had a Toyota photo shoot and I also had a haagen photo shoot on the same weekend I used tip number one where I batched the two use the same models so that I made X amount of dollars on Toyota photo shoot and made X amount of dollars on the haagen but this is an example you can use the same model same location and just quickly switch things in and out and maybe sometimes the photos might actually overlap in this case Case, it's a win-win for everybody. So these are my tips on how you can make $500 this weekend. Reminder again, tip number one is batch photography. Tip number two is stock photography. Tip number three is sign up for like these custom agencies such as Shutterstock Custom. Go out there, have some fun, start exploring different ways that you can make money with photography. Don't forget that it's gonna take a long time to build up to this, but I just want you to start going out there and trying. Maybe it's not $500, maybe it's 50 bucks, but each step of the way you're gonna keep charging more. And maybe you're already charging $500 and in that case, that's amazing, congratulations. Use the same principles and just charge more. Instead of doing headshots for $50, charge $250 or $300 and make like five grand this weekend. So that's just an example that I can give. Hopefully you guys see some value in these tips like this video it actually makes a huge difference subscribe I would love for you to join along comment below some other videos that you'd like to see in the future or some tips or questions that you might have I might address those in future videos and we'll catch you next time peace out everybody Woo!